This is one of the most popular plate carriers on the market and one that I've used personally. But does it hold up? Welcome back to Nylon Theory. Today on Gear in 90 Seconds, we're talking about the Defense Mechanisms MEPC, or Mission Essential Plate Carrier. This is a plate carrier that makes no pretenses about being anything other than a durable, well-made plate carrier that's designed for what most people need in a plate carrier. There's a lot I like about it. For instance, I like the chest molly, how it's done with laser-cut Velcro molly so that you can mount patches here for identification, or you can have admin pouches, EUD phone cases, whatever. I like the fact that it's Velcro in the front and rear for the cummerbund, so you can swap in aftermarket cummerbunds. That's going to become important in a second. I like the way that they mount the placards. I like the fact, especially, that inside the plate bags they have plate lifters to keep the plates at the proper ride height. But there's a lot I don't care for with these. For starters, uh, they don't have any structural cummerbunds in-house, so you have to go to someone like Axel or Shaw to get one made. And I don't like their use of these uh, rock buckles. I'm not a fan of them. And then the fact that they use this, this like foam or mesh on the back of the plate carrier, this stuff soaks up uh, sweat in the summer, and it gets really like soggy and miserable. I'm not a fan of that. I would prefer to have Velcro on the inside of the plate bags for pontoons just to keep the plates kind of spaced from my body. Also, these straps are very narrow when they're sitting upright and they kind of dig into your neck unless you use shoulder pads. I'm gonna be comparing these to some other plate carriers in the same price range, so stay tuned. 